from Affirm Films, your trusted source for inspiring, uplifting faith and family entertainment. Films that inspire and captivate. Can you believe we get to come out here every day? So what do we do now? We'll take it day by day. I have to believe that something good is going to come out of this. We will never experience anything like this again in our lives. Longest winning streak in sports history is now over. You've got to decide what you want to be. The only way I'm going out of this game is on a stretcher. No matter where we go or what we achieve, nothing's ever going to come close to what we have right here, right now. Stories that celebrate life and family. We all stick together. We can win this thing. Are you with me? Your mother would be proud. Movies that will surprise you. Do you, Scott, take Dan to be your lawfully wedded husband? I do. Do you know what's happening? The rapture. Timeless classics that will always be treasured. I cannot do this alone. Films that uplift and bring people together. What is there to believe in, man? I only know we in this together, man. We're done, Dad. I am not going to keep doing this. You can't love her because you can't give her what you don't have. So where are you, men of courage? I believe every father should step up and answer the call. And to say, I will. I will. You having a rough morning? Tell me it's all going to be okay. It's all going to be okay. Wow. Life is about finding the meaning and the joy and the purpose in all the chaos. Hun, your job. It's hard, I know. Important. Affirm Films. We deliver on the promise of wholesome and trusted entertainment. Share these inspiring movies from Affirm Films. If there's anything anyone wants to say, that was your shot. We will never experience anything like this again in our lives. My grandfather waits for me to get back from practice just so I can tell him how we're doing. I love you guys. We always say to finish strong, right? De La Salle streak and tradition continue. Our year. 12 years, 151 games in a row. But we were never just about winning. We were built on families. Do it, Nicole. Get my baby out of Richmond. And our town coming together. The longest winning streak in sports history is now over. But losing the streak tested us all. Let some punk pull you down at the two-yard line. Dad, please. Don't let a game define who you are. Let the way you live your lives do that. It's just a high school football game. Ever since day one, we've been doing what's best for us. You and me getting out of here together. You hear it from me? People always ask me what it's like to never lose. Today, I am lost. All the things I've taught, I don't know if I'm still doing much good here. I just want you happy and healthy. DNA! I got caught up in everything and let it nearly kill me. Coach, I'm alone. Family isn't just blood relatives. You've got me and 60 brothers. One, two, three, four! Coach told us, face your fears. Meet Buster Matthews, 330 pounds of pure aggression, and you're gonna face him the whole game. We got lost, caught up in the hype, the glory, and the relentless pressure. That's not who we are. We need to stand back up and find our way again. You've got to decide what you want to be. The only way I'm going out of this game is on a stretcher. You know why they call me Buster? Because you're stupid enough to let them. Brothers for life. No matter where we go or what we achieve, nothing's ever going to come close to what we have right here, right now. Stands tall. Mommy, 
Yes, Colton. Did you know I have a sister? You didn't know that Cassie's your sister? No, I have two sisters. You had a baby die in your tummy, didn't you? Honey, who told you I had a baby die in my tummy? In heaven, this little girl came up to me. She told me she died in your tummy. The pain that I suffered watching my son that close to death. We're in trouble. Will you call some friends and pray for him? The hospital said that your son was not expected to survive. Use the word miracle. Your son had a near-death experience. He saw things that I can't really explain. I lifted up and I looked down. Mom was in one room. You were in another room yelling at God. He's been out there staring for hours. Is something wrong with Colton? Why do you say that? Sometimes he says weird things. You had a grandpa named Pop, right? He died when I was about your age. He's very nice. You saw my grandfather? Where did you see him? In heaven. Is this the man you saw? No, in heaven, everybody's young. Is this him? Yeah, that's him. That's Pop. Honey, did you punch a kid in the nose? They were making fun of Colton. Yes, he's gonna get a spanking. Heck no. She's gonna teach it her hit without hurting her knuckles. I want to believe him. But everything he talks about is impossible. You saw heaven? What does it look like? It's beautiful. We all want to be supportive, but we can't have our town turn into a circus. They don't believe me, do they? Some people might be afraid to believe. Don't what? you think we need to be talking about this life? Do you think my son went to heaven? Mark. You don't have to worry. He told me everything was all right. He's making a difference. Haven't we already had a glimpse of something? From the first cry of a baby, the courage of a friend, the love of a mother, a father, I see it. So I believe in it. Do you? Well, when you get tired of the pipe, come surf some real waves. Bethany Hamilton is holding nothing back. Looks like she has a real future. And with her heart, her will, she'll go far. Thursday night's a full moon. We're all gonna go surfing. Sorry, Mom. I really wanted to go night surfing. Would you have let me go? No. I don't know. Can you believe we get to come out here every day? Teenage girl from the North Shore. Shark attack. Dramatic amputation. She's going into hypovolemic shock. Mom? The things that you're going to have to learn to do differently is extensive. I can't do this anymore. So what do we do now? We'll take it day by day. I don't know why terrible things happen to us sometimes, but I have to believe that something good is going to come out of this. What's all this stuff? A little fan mail. We sorted it out by country. There's an eighth grader from North Carolina who lost his arm. He's going to try out for a school soccer team because of me, and he's rooting for me in my next competition. Hey, Dad. I need your help. It's not going to be easy. I don't need easy. I just need possible. The greatest surfers. They know when the best waves are coming. You feel it. You have that gift, too. When you come back from a loss, when you beat the odds and never say never, you find a champion.
Sheriff's office. We have a warrant for your arrest. Back door, back door! Deputy Thompson has now survived his rookie year. Yeah. I guess that means you can start using real bullets now. <laughs> when you get married, have some kids, you're going to figure out real quick how much you don't know. You missed Emily's piano recital. Can I talk to you? Can I suggest that you spend a little more time with him? All he wants to do is play video games and go run five miles. What are you doing home? They let me go. Do you really feel like it messed up your childhood not having a dad? More than you know. Adam, I need you to come with me right now. Man, if it wasn't for my family, I'd be in a tailspin right now. You do heal, but you're never the same. I want to know what God expects of me. Me down the road. I've been doing about half of what I should have been doing as a dad. You're being too hard on yourself. Now I am Resolution? Yeah. You've been a good enough father. I don't want to be a good enough father. Can I sign this too? To find my I don't feel like I started well. I want to finish well. If you're going to do this, then do it right. Something like this needs ceremony. I feel like a rich man. As your father, I want the very best for you. I promise to take care of you. So where are you, men of courage? I believe every father should step up and answer the call. And to say, I will. I will. to inspect. You gotta clean this whole place up. Aren't they supposed to give notice? Aren't I supposed to be married to George Clooney? Who's George Clooney? Exactly, girlfriend. Exactly. <laughs> no breakfast till this place is spotless. Yes, Miss Hannigan. It's the hard knock life for us. It's the hard knock life for us. Sandy, wait. Stop. Why are you running? It gets me places quicker. Little kids. Will, this is really going to help your race for mayor. He's a foster kid from Harlem. I'm here on behalf of Will Stacks, and he would like to take Annie out for lunch. You can keep me as long as you want. <laughs> She's kidding. So what's the hustle? The more we're seen together, the better it is for my campaign. I bet if I moved in with you, you'd become president. You're not really thinking about doing this. Whoa. So this is what it's like living with a billionaire? The worst thing in the world you can get is a little taste of something good because it never lasts. And from then on out, the only thing that you can taste is not that taste. Huh? Do something nice for Annie, not just for the press. You get us sick? I've never been in the air before. I threw up on the swings once. Made you something. That's me, and that's you. Your secret's safe with me. That you care. It's a miracle. We found her parents. We think so. Well, hey, this is a joyous occasion. The sun will come out tomorrow. Bet your bottom dollar that tomorrow. We're gonna be okay, Sandy. There'll be sun. The sun will come out tomorrow. So you gotta hang on till tomorrow. Come on, man. When did this city get so musical? Sometimes what you're looking for is right in front of your face. Made your breakfast. Don't let your food get cold. Mm, okay. Annie, you got me eating this thing up like a dog. Mm, this is what is it? Mm, paprika? Mm, oregano?
Okay. It's blog time. I am a mommy blogger. I am a mommy blogger. Get ready, world, for some pearls of wisdom coming at you right now. So here we go. I got three followers. <laughs> Yesterday I had four, so that's awesome. My audience awaits. <laughs>